Hello, I'm Pedro Arenas, and this is Ask a Teen, a talk show created to shrink the generation gap, let teenagers break stereotypes, and share their opinions on a serious and sometimes less serious topics, and solve the ultimate game of Clue, which is, who is this new generation? It's a well-known fact that teenagers are very much stressed these days. The amount of homework and extracurricular obligations has increased dramatically during the past 20 to 30 years. To get into a good college, it's not enough to just have a perfect score or play sports or be involved in hip-hop dance. Nowadays, teenagers also have, are also expected to be involved in community service or charity organizations, volunteer, or make an impact on their surrounding world. But do they have time to relax after these? How teens have fun these days? How do teens have fun these days? Let's figure it out with these teenagers in the studio today with Maria, Alexander, and Ivan. Welcome, guys. Thank you. How you guys doing? Good. Good. We're good. good. Yeah. How'd you guys like to drive over here? It was three hours long. Oh, God. <laughs> I came all the way from Sacramento, so. Oh, man. Yeah, through yeah. traffic. Yeah, we're in Palo Alto right now, so that's far. Yeah. OK, question. Um, you guys are on summer right now, right? Yeah. You guys going to school right now? No, yeah. No. You go, you're going to school right now? Yeah. I'm doing accelerated geometry. Whoa. I'm also in school right now. I'm okay. Some requirements out of the way. <laughs> wow. Okay. So we we're we, it was kind of correct then when we said like you guys have to do more. Yeah. Kind of. You in school? Um, I'm in band, so like we have summer rehearsals. So. It's, it's like light. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. Then uh, you know, um, since you guys are kind of uh, busyish right now, but also too like you guys are sort of you know on this sort of I guess this loop of not really doing anything too. Mm -hmm. um, what do you guys do for free time? Uh, Bunsies. I play a lot of sports. Play like two sports, like varsity level. But I play water polo a lot. Okay. Like, mm -hmm. And swim. That's what I do for fun a lot of the time. What's what is water polo? Uh, it's this sport. It, I like the best way I can describe it is like kind of like soccer, and swimming and hockey kind of mixed together. <laughs> it's confusing. <laughs> Perfect, Maria. What do you do? For I dance. You dance. How so? Hip hop dance. Yeah. Really? Did yeah. I call it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's Got fun. It. All right. Cool. I believe it. Yeah. What about you? Um, I like to learn things. Like I like to go onto YouTube. I've started learning a lot about cars, and also like I like to hang out with friends. I'll either text them and go actually hang out with them in person, you know, talk to them in real life. And then there's also band rehearsals, which they're pretty fun because it's pretty much being around all pretty much like-minded people, and there's like a hundred of you, yeah. so it gets good. Yeah, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so uh, when you guys hear like you know, um, I guess sort of older generations talk about how. Uh, uh, when I was younger, I used to go outside a lot. Um, do you guys roll your eyes at that? Yeah. Kind of. Not really. Yeah, kinda. Really? Yeah. Do you think like there's some truth to it? What? Do you think there's some truth to it? <sighs> I don't know. It's really? complicated, yeah. I'll tell you right now, I think there's um, no truth to it. Really? I don't know. I, just, I, feel like, I feel like kids still go out. I don't know. Yeah. They do, actually. I see a lot of kids like playing basketball outside and like they just like walk around and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, before I got here, I was playing basketball with my friends. So. There you go. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's like sometimes, I don't know. I'm kind of mixed on it because like when I sometimes walk my dog outside, I see a lot more like usually like adults and older people than people my age, really? stuff like that. No, really? Yeah. So you think there's a little, just a little bit of truth to it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. I can see that. Um, let me see. Okay. Question though. Uh, we're going to switch this up a little bit. Um, what do you, what do you, what's a good location for like a date nowadays? I'll tell you right now, my favorite location, I have a... Uh, I have a girlfriend, and whenever we go out to a date, I, go, I take her to Five Guys because oh cause it's, just, it's just nothing but nothing but peanuts. You can eat peanuts all day. Mm -hmm. You can order like, oh, a shake, yeah, yeah. and then you get free peanuts for like mm -hmm. hours. Mm -hmm. You can stay there for an hour. You, you, can, you can stop eating. You can be on your phone. I'm going to guess like, she doesn't have a peanut allergy? No, no, no. She doesn't. She doesn't. <laughs> so you can stop eating for a little bit yeah. on your phone. Then you can start eating peanuts again, and they won't <laughs> kick you out. You can keep doing this infinity loop all day. <laughs> Where do you guys go? Oof, that's a hard question. I like to go everywhere. <laughs> okay. Like the most my favorite place is probably movies. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I just like watching movies. Yeah. Yeah. In and out. In and out. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, you were asking about to go eat. No, I mean like you can go on a, yeah, I, like I mean like you can go eat. I don't know. Sorry, I said it, I actually said date. Um, but I mean it doesn't have to be a date though. It could be like a date with friends, a oh, date with significant yes. other. I don't know. I don't know, if it's like with friends, like sometimes just meeting up like at a pool, okay. then if it's like a date, probably like going to like either the movies or getting some kind of food. Okay, okay. 
Um, I have another question too. Um, stay at home activities. What do you guys do? YouTube. Play cards. YouTube. Play cards. Play cards. Yeah. What? Me and my sister love it. Really? <laughs> yeah. What kind of what kind of card game? It's a Russian game. Okay. Uh, I don't know the name, but yeah, we just play like twenty four seven, like every time. Okay. You don't know the name, but what do you call it though? Cards. <laughs> really? You guys don't like. It's called like a like a dummy. I don't know. Okay. okay. Yeah. <laughs> you guys still use? You, do you guys use computers at all? Yeah. I do. Yeah. You do. Yeah. You do. Yeah. Okay. Mostly phone. Yeah. I feel like people are switching over now. Yeah. yeah. Like the language of like touchscreen is like. It's more yeah. comfortable. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, next question. Uh, do you guys uh, play video games no. at all? No, not at all. Yeah, yeah, very little. You do. Okay. Also, I too, do. I just wanted to let everyone know that the scientific consensus is in, and video games off have basically led to no. Sorry, I have a script actually. I didn't. I, one second. I got this. All right. Uh, the consensus-backed research since 2004 has showed no connection in violent video games to actual life fortality, including shootings. Moreover, a study in 2016 found that a reduction of crime in the weeks after major video games releases and a handful of similar studies conducted at a range of perspectives have shown the same conclusion. Psychologists around the world agree that violent video games do not lead to rage, aggression, and even stress. Oh. All right. Anyways, do you guys play video games? No. Yes. No. Yeah, you guys. I'm playing XCOM 2 right now, and I love it. <laughs> I think it's great. It's like a gambling machine for me, but oh. except I win nothing, except for losing time. Yeah. <laughs> what do you guys, what are you playing? I play very, I, I don't really play a lot, but I like to play CSGO sometimes. Wow. Yeah. And like, I, you know how the fact, you said the fact like, like makes people less violent. Like, I agree with that because it's like a shooter game and, you know, yeah. I haven't shot anybody. Except yet. for online. Yeah. You shot people online. Yeah. Pop some caps on yeah. the virtual Virtual world. Yes. You're definitely killing people, <laughs> but artificially. Yes. Yes. Shoot them in the knees and one in the head. Oh my god. Two yes. in the chest. But it's okay though. Yes. Because they're not really dead. For legal purposes, yes. They're still alive somewhere else. <laughs> yes. You're shanking mm -hmm. and cutting and slicing. Damn. But they're fine. Yeah. Cool. All right. Good stuff. Yeah. How about you? Uh, recently I've been playing a lot of Mortal Kombat at 11. Ooh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. You have, you have a little bit of the, the blood rage, too. All right. It's a, it's a fun game. I've been playing online and with friends. Yeah. So. It's a quench that you need, you need, to, you need to satisfy. I mean, not really, but sure. Okay. Yeah, I get it. Yeah. And you? I don't play any games. Good for you. Yeah. That's actually probably the best. It's really like, I don't know, I, see, I don't see any point in that. And it's just kind of boring for me because I'm a girl, you know. I, mean, I don't, I don't think, think a lot of does girls. Your, does a girl have a? I don't, I don't, I don't think, really. think so. Yeah. Girls just do makeup, you know, watch TV shows. My girlfriend plays um, this game. This she game does? called. Yeah, she plays this game called. Um, um, what's it? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Charm, Charm King. Hmm? This, this is not sponsored, by the way. This is not. This is. This is not. <laughs> Never sponsored. heard of that. It's called Charm King, and she's obsessed with it. What do you have to do in the game? You line up charms. <laughs> and the king. Oh, and then, then the king goes, "Hey, good job." <laughs> he pushes you on forward. It's pretty cool. I like it. Yeah. Or I mean, she likes it. Um, so you guys watch YouTube? Yeah. yeah. Okay. What do you guys watch on YouTube? I watch a lot of different things. Um, some of it's like tech related, like the YouTuber whose bracelets I'm wearing there. He's a very big tech YouTuber. Some camera things because I like to take photos and stuff like that. I like to watch those types of people. I've gone into cars recently. And a lot of it is just like video games, like, yeah. you know, funny yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. Right. How about you, Maria? Oh, I watch dance videos on YouTube. Really? And makeup videos, like James Charles. Do you, do you like, do you do it as like instructional? Like, oh, how do you do that dance? Oh, like, no, I've been dancing for seven years, so. I'm oh, like, wow. Yeah, I just like to watch it because I need inspirational to like freestyle and like to make my own choreography. Okay. So if I need it, I'm just go, I'm just, I just go to YouTube. Okay. Yeah. Makes yeah. sense. How about you? Uh, I watch like a lot of like comedy videos and then I watch like wa water polo games that I missed and I watch like uh, There's like one particular youtuber like named yes theory. They're really cool. I'm definitely I think I've heard him actually But I don't know. We're not gonna get into that though. Yeah. Um, you guys read books? I do. Yeah No, no you don't No. Me neither. I read books just very slowly Oh yeah. <laughs> like, it takes me a long time. Yeah. What was the last book you guys read? Oh, Ready Player One. Romeo and Juliet in school. Cool. The Martian. The Martian. Yeah. 
for school? No, I started reading it, I think, two years ago. I'm still, like, getting there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I read, like, one page every couple of months, so. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I think about, yeah, I have, to, I have to pause and think about it for a little bit. But I don't know. Like, I was like, oh, how did that play out? Who is that person? Yeah. Oh, God. All right, guys, look, we're almost out of here. Um, mm -hmm. Thank you for coming, though. But we have, uh, I want to do a quick uh, rapid-fire questionnaire. Okay, if you guys don't mind. Right. You guys yeah, cool with this? No. All, right. All right. So, question number one. What TV sitcom family would you be a member of? Don't watch sitcoms. Okay. Um, Full House. Okay. I don't know. Just name one, man. Um, yeah, yeah, go for it. Cool. I usually have like those kind of answers. But I, I don't know. I just, I don't have one. You want to give you one? Yeah. Um, all in the family. <laughs> all right, moving on. Uh, what product would you refuse to promote? Probably erectile dysfunction pills. Okay. Yeah. Really? Yeah. All right, cool. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you say that now. What about, <laughs> what about you guys? <laughs> oh, products that promote, like, yeah. um, like pollution and stuff like that. Okay. But just general pollution. Yeah. Hey, yeah, I pollute. <laughs> no, like, products that, put, like, pollute, like, they don't have, um, like, good, like, green waste initiatives. Plastic okay. straws. Oh, okay, cool. About you. Something of plastic. Like I'm really like and oh yeah that. yeah we have yeah we, I think we talked about it in our last last episode we have little microplastics in our bodies mm -hmm. it's crazy. I like my microplastics I named them now <laughs> <laughs> yeah I have names for them now it's good what are the names Charlie oh <laughs> all right uh, let me see what do you uh, what would you guys uh, cook for the perfect date you guys have okay so you guys are you have a kitchen you have a date coming over endless supplies what do you cook I love cooking mac and cheese i think it's like really fast and like easy okay. you mentioned mac and cheese like yeah i love mac and cheese okay. i ate it 24 7. okay <laughs> right. no actually for breakfast dinner okay. lunch okay all right i also like mac and cheese mm. okay. uh, chicken parm or something. chicken parm okay okay mm. what about you i'm not much of a cooking guy but if i was like barbecue grilling just steak and like good barbecue meat like mm. Mm. See, i think that's good date food actually yeah yeah I think so. Chicken mm -hmm. parm, mac and cheese. Yeah, you gotta cook what you know. All right. Um, let me see. Uh, what's your What's your best anti-stress? An anti-stress ball. An anti-stress ball. Yeah. Okay. Very. Okay. Yeah, I just squeeze it all the time. It's good. Sports. Sports. Yeah. Really. Yeah, I just play a bunch of different sports. It gets the stress out. Okay. Yeah, I got sports. Dancing. Pleasure. Dancing. When you're angry, happy, sad, you can dance whatever you want. Okay, I like that. You know what? I'm going to start dancing more. And on that, actually, I think we're done. So thank you for joining us, guys. Um, so this was, uh, this was Ask a Teen. And th also thank you for joining us in the, in the, in, in over there in, in TV land. If you guys have uh, some questions for the teenagers or want to be a teenager yourself, please email us at askateenshow at gmail.com. Once again, that's askateenshow at gmail.com. And uh, thank you so much. All right, guys. It's another one in the can. Pretty good stuff. Is that okay? Yeah. Is that right? It's good. Okay, good. I'm glad. First one I was like, I felt like, like you know, just a little bit rough with it. Like,